All right, guys, short video right here. All this video is about is how to track the baseball, okay? This is in BP, this is in the game. Anytime you have a ball coming to you, anytime you're doing drill work, whether it's, it's, it's in practice or in the game, I want you actually tracking the baseball. So many guys do not do this, and this is going to help you sharpen your game, sharpen your eyes, being able to read and see pitches, okay? Also, seeing where the ball is being caught by the catcher in the game is huge, so you can see the flight and actually see the difference between what you think the ball is going through the zone and how much it drops when it actually gets to the catcher in this point. So, if I'm in the box and I'm getting my pitches, okay, I'm right here. If it's a fastball, boom, I'm tracking that fastball right back to the catcher, okay, right to his mitt. If it's a curveball, same thing, boom, I'm gonna track that curveball right down to that catcher's mitt. If I'm working on BP and it's a pitch that I don't like, I'm here, it's an outside pitch, boom, I'm gonna watch and see where that pitch goes. Okay, don't like it. That's the pitch where I was looking at. It wasn't the pitch I was looking at, so I'm gonna take it. But know where the ball is. You're tracking the baseball always. Out of the, out of the pitcher's hand, as it's coming to the plate, as it gets behind you. Track it all the time. The more you are tracking baseballs, the better you're gonna be able to see the ball, pick up the ball, and understand and know the strike zone better. Too many guys think they know the strike zone, but yet they're not actually tracking the balls all the way to the mitt. They talk about in the MLB network all the time, especially Harold Reynolds, Make sure you are tracking the pitch every at bat, every pitch, every game. It's Laird's Training. It's the advice for the day. See you later.